This is Daimler's future packaged up into a truck. Okay, so I will stop here at the yellow line. Yeah. And then you can observe the, the power which is then going to the drivetrain. Here you will see how much is coming from the battery and how much is directly coming from the fuel cell. Yeah. Everything now is in play. So we have 400 kilowatts from the battery plus yeah. 200 directly from the fuel cell. Yeah. Which gives us a quite good acceleration. We have 85 kilometers already. Yeah. We. <laughs> Eighty-five kilometers, virtually from 400 meters, 600 meters. So to be honest, I've never no, measured never measured it. Yeah. yeah. It was fast enough. Yeah. Gosh. Yeah, that's phenomenal speed on that vehicle. I mean, you know, it's a bit different than a diesel. Yeah. <laughs> if I could see the mask, I think you'd put a smile on your face. Yeah. <laughs> it's a great toy. <laughs> quiet with mirror cam as well you've got no mirror noise at all have yeah, you yeah. it's really really silent in terms of that yeah mirror cams there you can see it so obviously that's Daimler what we don't have is we don't have any wind noise completely devoid of that which would normally be the main thing with an electric or hydrogen you've got wind uh, mirror noise but this doesn't have it at all as long as you are driving so fast uh, there is also no uh, is coming from any fans. No, because if, if you are driving at low speeds and uh, the fuel cell is still running on high power, then of course we have to use the electric fans. Yes, and that creates some some noise. noise. Yeah, yeah. But the much it's so fast, it's behind us anyway. The noise. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And there we have a, an EAC truss there, just doing a little bit of a just coming along there. Test and the actress. That's really, really impressive. Yeah, you've got some interesting toys in the research and development at the moment with the actress and yeah. uh, Gen 2, Gen H2. We, of course, also can do electrical braking. Uh, right, yes. Uh, first, we have to, to then. Uh, ramp down the, the fuel cell right because the the power that we can charge into the battery is is limited uh, right to 380 kilowatts here or so yeah that means if you if you want to uh, to get back the maximum during recuperation you have to uh, reduce the power of the fuel fine cell. yeah yeah so when you're doing regen maximum regen so yeah. you can you can actually get regen even in a fuel cell you can actually put power back into the battery by using the uh, the regen. Five, is it five stage? Yes. Yes, yeah, five stage. Just like an engine brake, but using brake regeneration. Yeah. That's great feeling. It's really, really good.